Hey guys, Jason Kelly here with Walnut Ridge. Another walkthrough Wednesday for you. I'm standing in front of Forest River's new FR3. This is a 30DS. It is one cool coach. It's a hybrid, so it's a mix between like a Class A and a Class C, and I'll show you why. Um, you can tell here it has these nice side marker cameras, so if you're backing in at the campground late at night, you don't have to have a spotter if you're by yourself. Really, really useful tool there. Tons of storage underneath this coach. So in this compartment, you have your, this is for your um, leveling jacks right down there. So easy to, easy access, you've got your battery, battery packs here. And then outdoor entertainment system. So you've got nice TV, so if you're tailgating, hanging out, you can definitely watch, watch the game. Outdoor speakers, indoor speakers as well. Huge power awning. Uh, it's well lit with the LED light underneath. Unfortunately, we don't have it going at the moment. Uh, again, more storage. And then this huge compartment under the rear bedroom. Um, nice big pass through there. We can actually walk around here, Greg. Uh, this does come equipped with the backup camera as well. So it goes hand in hand with that uh, side marker camera. You can tow behind this, so you don't you know tow a small car with you, and you don't have to worry about you know unhooking everything if you're at a campground and going to town. You can just take a small car. And on this side, we have more storage. Here's your outdoor systems for water. So you've got your water tank fill, uh, fresh water tank fill, and black tank flush. Outdoor shower as well, so if you're at the beach, you can spray everybody up, not get sand inside the coach. More storage. Oh. Now this is a cool feature. This is Yamaha's new um, generator. It's a 5,500 watt. This, this guy is really cool. You can, if you have any issues with it, it's carbureted. So it's supposed to work a lot better in the mountains as well as uh, lower elevations. Um, it does have a pull start option. So if you're running out of power it, in, for some reason, the electric start or the remote, it even has remote start. If that remote starts not working, it does have a pull lever so you can get power. So really cool features. Um, and another thing is you can pull into any Yamaha dealer. So you can go to like a motorcycle shop and they can work on that for you um, without an issue. So. That should be a really nice feature for you as well. There's your LP. We'll go ahead and go inside the coach here. Now we can show you why this guy is a hybrid. So this bunk here can go in an up position or down. You can actually drive while it's down. A lot of coaches will not have that feature. So that's a huge bonus for storage if you want to get to something easy to get to. So I'm going to put this in the up position really quick and then show you what it's like because these three cabinets kind of act as if a safe so if you're parked away from your coach you can actually raise this bed and it will block those three compartments so here it is in the up position um you have this nice mirror as well as you kind of gives you a, a better angle here for the um digital system here so that does have apple play you can hook up apple play or android to that and run run that through your phone um really cool features again this is the new 7.3 liter uh ford v8 so lots of power a lot more power than that old v10 had ford's really done a nice job with with that engine so in this coach you have two options one option is theater seating or sofa the other option is washer and dryer so only two options. Um, so these do recline down, uh, do have cup holders, super comfortable. And then you do have this nice booth shaped dinette, or uh, I'm sorry, U-shaped dinette. And comfortable for an adult, you know, shorter adult, maybe, maybe kids. So perfect for a small family. Um, as well as you do have the bunk for additional sleeping. A nice add-on they've done is this counter extension. So that's one thing with our camper. Sometimes we don't have quite enough storage space and this does help out with that quite a bit. Barn style, stainless steel sink. And you can actually even, I love these. You can just put this right over your sink and it'll 
you know, dry your dishes off so you don't have to have a, an additional rack for dishes. Um, plenty of storage in here, as well as these three drawers. This actually makes additional counter space. Awesome feature. That drawer, when it pulls out, and this does remove there. And then you do have a little larger oven. So, I don't know if you've ever cooked in, in your small camper oven, but this does give you quite a bit more space there. Huge fridge, double door, just like your house with freezer. And this is equipped with a max air fan. So these are really nice. That'll run off 12 volts. So if, if you don't have power for whatever reason, you just want to use your house batteries, you can still use that max air fan and kind of open the windows and create a nice cross breeze. So this does have a pass-through bathroom. Nice big shower. I mean, plenty of room. Uh, I'm 5'9", and I have plenty of room in here, so. Oh. <laughs> and then here is your restroom. In the master bedroom here. So you do have a king-size bed. You have these three independent storage bins on top of the bed here with a power outlet and a 12 volt receptacle. Nice big hanging locker for clothing. And then you have a total of one, two, three, four, five storage bins underneath, as well as your washer and dryer. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me, Jason Keller, 765-533-2288. Uh, I'd love to answer any questions. We don't have pricing on this particular coach yet. We actually just pulled it in. So please feel free to reach out. And again, uh, it's super cold out here. So if I've missed anything, don't hesitate to ask.